Good day, brothers and sisters. I wanted to bring something quick to y'all before I get back to some Vatican Catholic Church stuff. Now, just watch this clip. This was before the East Palestine train derailment, before the movie came out. I don't know if it happened before that while they were filming the movie or what, because it takes about a year to film a movie and all that. But check this out. Out to make a big impact. Yeah, East Palestine's excited to make an important medical device available to all 4,700 residents. I told you about it in October. 4,700 residents. There's that number, 47. Or start signing up. The My ID program is ready to roll out in East Palestine. It's a medical information system which helps first responders provide care. And it gives us that rapid information that we may need should somebody be unresponsive or having some kind of medical emergency. My ID provides wearable devices or key fobs which have QR codes. Emergency responders use a camera phone to access important medical information. It shows them the underlying medical conditions you've supplied about allergies, medications, even emergency contacts. That information could impact treatment decisions if a person can't say it. All of the information is HIPAA compliant. My ID is available in East Palestine and Unity Township. The fire department will demonstrate it to other departments which provide backup. My ID can be used anywhere. Sunday, residents can learn more during a special meeting at the East Palestine Community Center. We want to bring people in to get um, signed up to pick their device if they want. Um, and just so we can see what how who all is interested in it. People who are ready can sign up and pick their device. It's free. The village has five thousand dollars in donations to cover the first phase of two hundred fifty devices. Anybody that's skeptical, please come on down, sit down, and talk to us. We'll be happy to show you everything that goes on with it. We'll be happy to show you how secure it is. Now, people who sign up Sunday could get their devices within a couple weeks, and that's when my ID will go live. Any phone camera. Is it just me, or does this? This was, uh, I got this. I can't find the actual clips, but this was off this guy, Cinema Shotgun. It was weird how I just woke up the other morning, and this was in my scroll. Now, check this out. So on top of that, what are the odds that the iWatch has a band called the Palestinian Watch, the Palestine. And then check this. You're going to see one that says Free Palestine. That one says Palestine on it. And now you're about to see one that says Free Palestine. Vintage. I watch band. They were giving them away for free. They would like to cover all 4,700 residents. And then magically, bam. Huge man-made disaster that our government won't even do anything about. Biden goes to Ukraine to give them more money instead of going here to do something. So who did show up to go do something? Our former president. Donald J. Trump went there to go give them, I think he gave them like $500 million to help with this. But Trump goes there, which is, you know, he cares about the American people, right? That's going to be huge in this next election is who cares about the American people? Who's more about killing people and who's more about saving people? Now, check this out. Donald J. Trump was the 45th president. Biden, I can't even say Joe Biden's full name. <laughs> I, I'm just, I'm disgraced to the guy. I don't care about either side, but you pick the lesser of two evils. And that usually becomes the worst evil even by doing that. But the 46th president was Biden. The 45th president was Trump. Take a guess what number comes next. 47. And look at the connection we already made with Don, with, with uh, 47, Trump, Operation Warp Speed, influenza shots, started in 1977 to 2020, 47 years, brothers and sisters. And we're coming up on the 47th president. Now, there's a scene in Moonfall that I want to bring to you all that gives us a date about 2024 of October, which in that video... 
I will bring to you my personal thoughts of the movie. Stay blessed. Stay safe, brothers and sisters.